Gamer Dude 2088 here, and I want to sit and talk about this dice event. It's a little bit different from what I normally like to do, but I guess I'll talk about it anyway. It seems like this is pretty good for y'all F2P players, free to pl uh, free to play for y'all that don't know. This is a beautiful event for you guys because now you get a chance to get a uh, light and dark light darkness scroll, a bunch of mana, experience booster, bunch of crystals and mystic scrolls and rainbow mine, all that nice little jazz for doing this mission. And pretty much is you get one free die to roll and you get additional ones by completing completing missions and stuff. So and it, it's simple. You have power up revolutions ten times, into the arena ten times, that's including rival encounters and and all arena battles. Then you have win PvP 30 times. That's all scenario, uh, scenario, dimensional riff, and Carol's Trials of Ascension and Raid Battles count. But with trial, uh, but no guild battles or world boss. With Trials of Ascension, you have to do a, a level that you didn't already complete. So this is pretty cool. And then here it says complete mission below to get one additional dice and 10,000 mana stones. So you have, as long as you complete missions, you get... You get uh you get an extra die and then you get mana stones on top of it, which is always clawsome because who doesn't want more mana? Cause runes are freaking hard to level up when you don't have mana. So and then you hear your checkpoint rewards, first checkpoint a hundred ener energy and then two two hundred uh thousand mana stones on a second one and third three mixed scrolls, fourth you get your rainbow mom max uh, four star and a 12 hour experience booster that always helps and then your last uh your last checkpoint here the fifth one you get 200 crystals so essentially you get 300 300 crystals and this is good especially for your 2p players so that gives you a chance to be able to do refills and refills which which is uh helpful and for everybody else i mean come on as much money as I spend in this game, it's all it's always good to have an event that's going to, you know, give back a little bit to me. So I do appreciate that come to us, that you have such a cool event for the two-year anniversary. Yeah, this DICE event is real good. Once this event start, I recommend everybody to start doing this every single day, getting this in, getting your rewards, because you get at the end of it, well, once you first uh, clear... Let me make sure I'm saying this right. Let's say you uh, roll the dice to hit and head for the finish line. You will get rewards marked on the spaces you land on and be rewarded with a scroll of light and darkness when you finish a lap. Only once. Of course, it's going to be only once. Light and dark scrolls are rare, but you get to get a light and dark scroll and it's already hard enough to get them if you're not spending money nowadays. So, you know, get... The Get to doing this. Like, as soon as it starts, like, you guys need to get on this shit because this is detrimental for your progress in this game. This is the Gamer Dude signing out, saying, see you in the next video because there's always good, nice content coming from me. I got more funny vids and I'm still, I'm still, been, I've been bullshitting because I do got music coming. I do got music, some more Summoner's War songs. I haven't really been working too diligently on it. I just got my computer back because it it needed to be fixed on because my editing program was lagging the computer. So I had to get some RAM adjustment. Um, I ended up probably having to buy some more RAM. But that's it, though. But do this event, DICE event. This is going to be nice, man.